how's it feel being here with Pops? I mean, he's the man tonight. I'm very proud of him. <laughs> I'm very proud of him. He's brought me up yeah. well. Yeah. He's talented. He's got a bright future ahead of him. He's taught me everything I know. <laughs> so you're doctor in this movie, and uh, we don't want to give too much away, but just the experience and being around everybody. Tell me about the time where you saw, was there a moment where you saw everybody in costume? Uh, no. There wasn't a time like that. And unfortunately, I had one scene with, with, uh, with Iron Man, but that was just a ball on a stick because he was supposed to hover in the air above me. So, and Were you in your Mamma Mia costume? I had my Mamma Mia yes! costume on. <laughs> and you beat his ass, right? Yeah. How did he look? In the Mamma Mia costume? Yeah. Oh, check it out. He's pretty bad. Spandex, and that's like he's... He looks surprisingly good in spandex, actually. So you never got to see everyone together at once? No. Oh, so this is going to be the first time for you. Yeah. Have you seen I haven't the movie seen the film yet? Have you seen it? It's, yeah, it's, it's good. Great. And, and, yeah, we saw it yesterday. I, I love how we, the media, we didn't even work on the thing. We've seen it before you. What's up with that? Yeah, I live in Sweden. It's a very remote country. Oh. Yeah. I think the premiere should be the first time they all see it. Okay. It's such a big event. I yeah. thought maybe they just satellite the thing into Sweden. But when you're back here in Los Angeles and the madness, and, you, and, and your son is, like we were saying, he's a big deal as well, and people start caring about personal life and relationship is it so different when you're back home do people care about all this stuff well, they do but I, I don't think it's as bad as it's here i mean it, I, I can walk the streets i carry the groceries home with the diapers and everything it's the paparazzi doesn't life. follow you yeah it's definitely not the, you don't see this in sweden very yeah. often not even at a big premiere no. what, uh, what's the secret when annoying media like myself ask you about you know the paparazzi following you and, and people you're dating like how do you deal with stuff like that are, are, you, are you used to it yet well I think dad taught me a lot like growing up with him being um, a famous actor in Sweden that it's uh, you learn that there are certain things that you want to keep to yourself that you want to keep private that's between like you and your loved ones that you don't want to share with everyone out there and you got to give some but it, I think it's important to not give it all uh -huh. keep a little privacy Keep a little privacy. You just wanted to know if you brought a date. That's all I was trying to ask. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Dad. Yes. Right. Thank you, Alexander right. Stellan. It was great. Really good job. Seriously, you did a fantastic. And uh, can't wait for everybody to see it. I'm excited to see it. Thank myself. you. Yeah.